know this is a pretty straightforward video. It's about priming your Detroit engine. This happens to be a 2019, and from what I've seen over the years, they're all pretty similar, you know, in terms of finding where your primer is. So I'm gonna show you how to find that primer and how you use that. Just a couple examples of why you might need this. Let's say you're trying to start the truck and it's cranking, but it's not firing, so you're not getting fuel, or maybe you had an issue, you just had to change a filter, maybe you just changed your, your pre-DAVCO filter or something like that. And it could be a few of these different things and now you need to prime it and you're on the side of the road. Yada yada. You've decided priming the engine might be a good idea at this point. So on the Detroits, here's where you go. It's this little guy right here. You gotta unscrew it. And then up she pumps. There it is. And then you just go like this. Now this truck's not having issues, so it's not the perfect example. It is gonna be a little tough. But what you have to do is you just pump that up and down just like that over and over again. And if you're used to older engines, you're gonna hate this because you're gonna have to do this like 200 times. I'm not joking. It takes a long time. And you just keep going until this gets really stiff. And then once it gets really stiff and really hard to push down, you push it down and screw it back in. And that should mean you're primed. Although my experience has been, you can go try starting the truck, see if it gets started. If it doesn't, you may have to come back out, prime a little more because it may have worked in some air bubbles or something like that. So there's just a quick video on priming a Detroit engine. Well, I hope you found this video really helpful. If you want to, click right down in here. This is the subscribe button. That'll give you more of our helpful videos. And then after that, come over here and click here for more of our videos. Remember, truck drivers are American heroes. Let's make truck drivers great again and keep on trucking.